Welcome back guys. I have a special video here. It is a dealer spotlight actually, Anointed Sounds. I have Bruce Ball here who's going to talk to us about this dealer. Bruce, welcome back. Thank you. I'm the importer for uh, Scansonic, Margulis, and uh, Via Blue. And our local authorized dealer here is Anointed Sounds, David and Nikki McBride. Welcome to my channel. Thank my you. first dealer spotlight here at a show, okay? So I'm very excited to bring you a full-blown video about this local business. Guys, it's a pleasure having you here. Awesome. Well, I am so excited to be here today at the Southwest Audio Fest with the great Jay's Audio <laughs> Lab. Like, this is a dream come true. And of course, my amazing husband, David, with Anointed Sounds, the best audio video company in the DFW Metroplex. You better come get your Margulis amplifier, yeah, love it. your RBH speakers, your Scansonic, yep. Rayho, oh my God. If it wasn't for our sales guy, Bruce, I mean, I wouldn't even know what to do because he thought of us coming here today. So I'm so excited to be here. What about you, baby? Love that energy. <laughs> love that energy. You okay. excited? Yeah. Well, I just want to just encourage the women out there that may be like, okay, yes. audio, my husband wants these bulky speakers. When I tell you, they can go beautiful with your design. Audio is really like artwork, but it's that artwork that you can not only just look at, you can feel it. So we're gonna show you some pictures of some of the work that we've done, anointed sounds that have made rooms come more alive, not only with the look, but the sound. And make it look pretty. That was awesome, yeah. great energy. Uh -oh. That was phenomenal. Yeah. No, hold on. I want I want you to do yes, you need to exit. She is. You are a natural. I I was afraid. Thank you. I was like, you got a problem now. <laughs> I know. Oh, you got a problem. You see my little lead. You, you see my full. You got a follow. follow that. Okay. So now let's transition over to David McBride, husband and of course owner as well of the Anointed Sounds. David, welcome to the channel. All right, man. Nice to meet you, brother. Thank Talk you. to me a little bit about this business, how it got started, okay. what happened. I mean, I want to know the journey. I want to okay. give my viewers the back end, the, the beginning of your oh, okay. business. So basically, man, I'm a country boy. I was born in the country, and uh, my father's a mechanic, so I started out in 12 Volt. He always had amazing systems in his cars, amazing home systems, and he kind of started me the basis with wiring, so I started wiring automobiles, putting in audio and vehicles first. Then we came along in about 91, 92 when home theater first kicked off. You know, it's sound to me, sound, sound. Yep, that's true. So we started doing it. But as for me, what drives me is that I remember, even when I was young, my, both my parents were big music people. So they had vinyl, record players, and all that stuff, and they would go to concerts. So for me, that's every job I do, that's the reference standard that I'm trying to get my client as close to as possible, is that if you've ever been to a live concert, that's the expectation. That sets the reference point. So... Live experience is what drove me, because we would go to concerts, my, my dad would take us to concerts, and so when I got older, I would go, continue to go to concerts, so I'm just a sound guy. People say, oh, they would call me Super Dave or Dave the Audio Guy, so, you know, just like any journey, you start doing sure. it for friends and family, and then it kept growing, you know, and then, then I met my beautiful wife. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love you, baby. Oh, Lord. It's awesome. See? This is what we do at Jay's Audio Lab. Jesus. I love this, this emotion, this passion for this hobby. You don't get to see this every day. And to bring this to you guys here means the world to me. I'm getting chills just seeing this, okay? This is not what you typically see on an audio show, but this, this level of energy, passion, and love for what they do is why I recommend this business. I mean, to see the, not only that, the personalities behind the, you know, the way they handle business, the way they talk to customers, this is real here, folks. Tell us a little more, then continue. So, so it's all good, man. So good. Man, it's all good. Man. So good. So good. Let's keep going. So you know, you know. So the God gave me the gift. Uh, I mean, I've just been, it's just, I've been gifted at sound. I've I've had been blessed to do it in the pro part. And early in high school, I had friends that did recording. They were recording artists. So I got a little bit of studio, and then we do commercial and we do residential. But the missing ingredient was my wife. She when God brought us together, and then it elevated the company we started so I started out I worked for a couple of shops and then I worked for a couple of independents and then my first major job was at the home theater store at that time here in Dallas there's only three viable options them 
Hillcrest High Fidelity, and then uh, Stereo East. And they were all like on the same street block, back to back. So then I left there, and then we started up, we got married, and we started our business in 97. Wow. So, so for some reason, I thought you guys had only been in business for like four years or something. Uh -uh, no. And now I find out, no, no, this has been a long time coming. Yes. And now you're expanding into two channels. You're doing yes, two channels. You're doing a lot more, uh, yeah. th adding more things to your portfolio, which yes, it's really, really, really cool to see. Um, and uh, so now you're going to walk us through briefly yeah. this system, which okay. we already highlighted. Yeah. Tell us a little more about it. Thank you for being on camera. <laughs> Appreciate that energy. <laughs> So of course, well, this system is uh, this is a uh, Margulis product, which is a Mexican manufacturer, the only high-end Mexican manufacturer of products. But this is one of the amplifiers. Uh, basically, these are their sources: the Bluetooth device, so people that want to Bluetooth from their phones or tablets. And this is the streamer. So if you want to stream music and get a better quality of sound, you can go with the streamer. Uh, these speakers are actually it's not, this is what I had in my bedroom system. This is that right model. bedroom speakers. <laughs> they in my bedroom, in, right here. <laughs> blended amazingly, as you can see on the pictures right now that they shared with us, it's been incredible. Like what they do to, you know, uh, to their entire to the entire look of the system is great. What you guys can do, and I think customers are going to really love that extra uh, level of creativity that you yep. bring to the table. Yeah, and then so. We've always been kind of what I call the salmon. You know, we swim against the grain. We don't, we're not necessarily supporting a product just because of the name. You know, it's got to be a good quality product. Yep. Got to have the right pricing. And most yep. importantly, got to have the right support. Yes. Which, thank God, which is, we got, it's a blessing we met Bruce at Expona. Yep. He's taking us to another level. But awesome. Because of him, we have a, traditionally we had Nordos speaker wire cable sets is what we use, uh, Wire World, and then uh, Bruce's product, the RSXX cables. But, now we're using this Fire Blue product as well, so we like to, kind of like what you said with Bruce, take value in the products, yes. you know, and then put a, put together systems, not brand name oriented, but performance oriented, so you get the most bang for your buck. Price performance propositions. Yes, sir. Let's walk over to the next yeah. room because we haven't talked about that one, mm -hmm. so that my audience can see what else you are offering here. Okay. So over here, um, well, let me get to so. <laughs> I went to a supplier and I saw they had this brand called RBH, which I, had, I wasn't familiar with. They had architecture product. So I'm like, okay. So then when I met Bruce at Expona, a lot of stuff transpired that year. So I go there and I meet Bruce. And, you know, and we had, prior to meeting Bruce, we sold Scansana product. Okay. Phenomenal product. But we were, at that point, they didn't have a supplier in the United States, so we had to deal directly with them, which customs and all that, so we let it go. So when, he, when I saw Bruce, he had the product, he said, okay, you don't have to do that now. You get it to me. I'm, I'm importing from here. So that's how we got reconnected with that brand. But on RBH product, um, I went to Cedia, and I, I saw it up close and personal for the first time, and what drew me was their subwoofers. So, which, at this event, I think that if it's, um, it's safe to say that as far as low frequency reproduction, I don't think anyone can, can touch a, hold a candlestick to our room. So basically, I started out, like you said, I bought it for my personal use and tried the subwoofers. And so ultimately, I got the, at that time, it was the largest subwoofer, the Dual 12. It's in my theater room right now. And it, it, from there, I, I, you know, I signed up as a dealer, started purchasing product, and it's one of our favorite brands too. And this is my representative for my sales account, Kenny. And so we invited him. He's their phenomenal support. Important, like I said before. So what clients don't realize is that every you have the mainstream companies that you see on the television sure. ads, commercial ads. But the other side of that, and I, we found out through experience that you have the company name, but the support factor is the make or break deal for us. Oh yeah, absolutely. There's a lot of big yes. name companies they'll sell your product, but don't don't have a problem. Yep. So we steer away from that, and only so we're real meticulous on who we choose and what products we use because important is very important to us because it's, from our client standpoint, when we service our clients, we start out as a service company first, but we also do product. So if our clients should have an issue, it's not, from, my, from our standpoint, it's our problem. So we make sure that they can take care of it. And if we don't have the support on the back end with the manufacturer, then we don't want to deal with them. I always say to uh, brands, okay, any brand in particular, I, I'm not going to mention any brand in particular, but generally speaking, if the dealer cannot get a hold of the brand, trust me, the customer cannot get a hold of the brand either. Yeah. 
I promise you that. Yeah. So dealers should be doing exactly that. If they're trying to get a hold of the brand and they are non-responsive, you need to you need to run as far away as possible from them. Yeah. Stay away from that because when your customer has, customers have problems, you are the face as a dealer of that transaction. Yeah. The dealer is the one that has to deal with that painful experience yeah. and then try to make it right for the customer because it's not the customer's fault. The brand is non-responsive. So that's why I tell dealers, stay away from any brand that doesn't pick up the phone. I am actually dealing with something similar right now, but it has nothing to do with the audio world. Yeah. It's got to do with the car industry. Wow. So I am getting feedback from yeah. certain brands, certain dealers who tell me, we want to sell you that, Jay, but I'm telling you right now, they're yeah. a beautiful product, but nobody yeah. picks up the phone. Yeah. And we have a lot of issues. We get a lot of gear that's damaged. They don't respond. It takes months to make it right. Wow. And that's so terrible. keep that in mind. So thank you for calling that out and making sure yeah. that you're doing your homework and diligence yeah. when it comes to only selecting those partners that are responsive and that are definitely tr very faithful to you and your yeah. customers. Here is a customer of theirs that will give you some feedback about their experience with anointed sounds. Uh, Introduce hello. yourself. Yes, sir. I'm uh, Raleigh Williams, my wife Kimberly Williams, and we are definitely a testimony to what anointed sounds has done for us. Uh, my wife and I purchased our, our dream home about two years ago. Congratulations. And, and thank you, thank you. It's a wonderful home and we wanted everything to acclimate or be uh, representative, it, representative in that home that we have built up into this time. Um, so part of that was going out and finding a good sound system. Um, and I talked to, I'm a real big research guy. I went out and talked to multitude of companies about what I wanted and no one could give me everything. Um, one company could do the patio, but had problems with the theater room. One company could do the theater room, but couldn't really understand my vision for the patio. And just by chance, I was talking to a neighbor one day, and he said, well, hey, you know, there's a company, Anointed Sounds. It's this guy, David McBride. And I said, well, I've never heard of him. And he said, well, here, I'll give you his number. So I literally went in and called David McBride and hey, where do you live? And I told him where I live. He said, well, hey, I, I live extremely close to there. I could be there in 10 minutes. Come on. It's 10 minutes later, he comes over and he walked me through his vision of what the living room system was going to be, the patio system was going to be, the theater was going to be, and it lined up exactly with what we wanted. I mean, to a T. And I went to some high name, big wow. brand companies That's in nice. the area. A lot. I mean, I went to one that everybody knows everyone knows and they just couldn't get it right you know they really couldn't and david came in and he was like hey i, I know exactly what you want i know exactly what you need as a matter of fact brother i'm gonna throw in a little extra for you and nice. i was like hey you know what a way to earn a new customer exactly <laughs> faithful uh, customer and, right and there. let's do it and i mean two years later we've had you know a hiccup here or a hiccup there and i can call him and say hey david walk me through how to do this well here let me show, let me tell you this do this and if he has to come out, he comes out. He gets it working right, and I mean, everything is just spot on. The support you were talking about, oh, the support is phenomenal. You know, it really is. They have done just a great but job. But here's the most important part. Yes. Is the wife happy? Yes. Is the wife, wife. happy? <laughs> the wife is extremely happy. Um, and what I love about Anointed Sounds is um, David and you know Nikki are amazing. Nikki is also an interior designer, so my concerns about big bulky speakers and what it's going to do to the house. I mean, the <laughs> way that they work together, it's seamless, it's beautiful, and the customer service. That's one thing as a wife. When things break down, you don't want it on the honey do list for 15 weeks. So <laughs> to wow. have a provider that will come out immediately and get you back up and running, it's nothing like it. So we we love them. We would recommend them to anyone. Oh, definitely. Amazing experience. Great testimony, guys. Yeah. Thank you for sharing that with us. Gives a lot of people confidence to call Anointed Sounds. Clearly highly recommended yes. by the both oh, of you. Definitely. And definitely. as far as the customer service, I'm assuming you guys are oh, exceptional. Wonderful. Yeah. There you have it. Top of the line. Okay, so bring back David to, for final words on this video. <laughs> David, so we heard a customer of yours speak highly, of course, about the time and the experience with you. Um, and that's so good to see because we see a lot of dealers or businesses in general uh, speak highly about what they do, but having someone that can validate that work, yeah. that's a real customer, means that much more. Yeah. So I'm happy to hear great things are coming from your business. And of course, your wife and you, in my opinion, the short time that I've been talking to you seem to complement each, each other quite well. Yeah, I can't do without my wife. Because 
the vision, she said it, the, you know, the, the artistic side of you, you know, the, and, and, the, and, and what women need oftentimes, right, to kind of design, hey, I want all of that, but how can we make it work so it's just blended beautiful in the room? And that's, I think, those eyes, I'm sorry, we're not good at that as men. We just aren't. I'm telling you, we want, I want the big stuff all over the place. Yeah, Women don't. That's why they kicked me out of the house, by the way. But that's a topic for another story for now. So, guys, it's been an incredible time. Any last few words? And I want to say that really the reason we're here, number one, is because of God. All the years we've been doing it, the people that God has left us to come in contact with, just we got the best clients in the world. That's all I can say. Awesome. <laughs> hey, we got the Jay's Audio yeah. Lab effect, y'all. Whoever don't know him, you're going to know him today. Go on YouTube. Thank look you. him up. So yeah. this is a God moment. And he My gives husband. out valuable printed information. It's yes. A, there are a ton of reviewers. Come and, on, you know, we've seen a lot of them, but there's only really a small group of true reviewers. Thank Some of those guys are just enthusiasts. And they don't have them, in my opinion, on what they're talking about, you know. But anyway, it's, you. we're in a YouTube wow. age, so it's what he has is rare. Yeah. Thank so you. So you need to follow him and, and stay in touch. Much appreciated, guys. Yes, and man, we, we are so thankful. My husband, he deserved this moment. These tears are real. He's been up for literally, what, four days? <laughs> yeah. Between Kenny, like RBH, sure. and Bruce. Yes. Ankle swole, but steady going. It's all good. I mean, his whole soul going to what yeah, we I can do. Yeah, I could see his whole fiber. Man. Like Very he passionate. don't even get haircuts, but he got a haircut for this occasion because you got to do that though. This was yeah, important gotta... to him. And I don't get haircuts though. You, don't... you know, <laughs> <laughs> this is so amazing. So I'm so grateful that God is allowing the world to see what's been in him for years. And awesome. Now everybody following his true passion. Yes, and you can follow him again at Anointed Sounds uh, Audio Video uh, on Instagram and then Anointed Sounds dot com is our website and then created to build by Nikki. I'm his wife that just I'm here to serve and work with my husband and I'm so grateful to just be here today. Lovely and couple. Thank you, Steve, for yeah. coming. He's not on camera, but he came to support us. Yeah. So we're so grateful. Thank you, Williams family. It was yeah. just amazing, y'all yeah. here. These are real life stories where David have helped so many people in very difficult yeah. situations, David and I. Yeah. Uh, and they called us up, and he was able to bring the solution. People Great. just like Dr. Phil as well. You need people so like that around you David that can help you. To help yeah. Can't do this alone. Yes, yeah, no. so we nope. thank God for the Williams family for being a testament. And one quick and shout so. out to our brother, too. I remember, yes. so you go to a, you meet a client. You never know what it's going to tell her, but sure. you know, you go there. And so I'm talking with him, and he was like, yeah, uh, I'm going to the room, and I'm looking, and I'm, I'm, you know, all this recollection of all the homes we've done, like, yeah, you put a screen here, and we put a project in the studio, and he's like, you know what? He said, everybody else except for you wanted, said to put a TV in the room was too small. And I'm like, well, it's a room, you know, so, that's, and then I measured, like, no, you can put, we do rooms like this all the time. But that's an example of how, one thing as far as, my Mastin perspective is is there's the part where you know you got preconceived thoughts of what you want to put in and stuff, but you have to be a good listener of the customer. Agreed. And he made Agreed. it perfectly clear to me that he wanted a large size image. Agreed. And so that's and like he said, uh, so for me, it's never a point of that nothing is impossible. It just that to what extent it needs to be to get the job done and how much it's going to cost. But that's their decision, not mine. Yeah, that's so exactly. like I tell him, I said, man, if you want it, we can do it. Now, it might, you know, some stuff might change and we have to, you know, modify the price, but, and we put it together and then praise God, you know, and that, and I like, like the one emphasis too, and I told him, like I tell all our clients, like, now that we're done, it's your house, but it's, you know, our name is on it now. So any problem you have, I need to know immediately. Awesome. Because we don't want, like you said, you don't want time to linger. Because nope. then by then, it, it may be a small problem, but then that problem will lead to another problem. And I like the fact that he's quick to respond and call me and then we can get him taken care of and, Beautiful. Well, there you have it, guys. Thank you for that support. Hit that like button. Until next time, peace. Bye.